so here is the other world that makes martial arts talent, Khabib Nurmagomedov, and there's so much made about his value as a corner man. Tonight, though, he is competing and has Bulas in his corner. Yeah, Coach Khabib is as undefeated as fighter Nurmagomedov compete again. This guy is the definition of pressure. He is trying to take you down, and he does not hide his intentions. He wants to get in your face, he wants to take you down, and he wants to drown you. This guy is a savage, he's a beast. Every word that describes that is Habib Nurmagomedov with a bull in his corner. for this heavyweight championship fight. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Herb Dean, our referee Ready, for this fight. one. Ready, good. He is undefeated, he is one of the best pound for pound fighters in the world, and what a pain in the neck he is to fight. Habib Nurmagomedov figures to go to the takedowns early and often here tonight, but if he needs to strike, we have seen a constant evolution when it comes to his striking. This is one of the best fighters in any division, and Khabib Nurmagomedov back at it tonight. A oh, little single collar tie there. Too easy, Khabib Nurmagomedov gets the early takedown. Opposition knew it was coming, unable to stop it as usual. Well, he'll tell you, he'll tell you that he's gonna take you down. And he has so many ways of getting to that takedown. He's as good as they come in terms of setting him up, and right away he gets to fight exactly where he needs it to be. There it is, now he's going to mount. Oh, nice. All right, he's hanging out inside the closed guard of his opponent here, DC, you gotta be careful. Sever gets up, he is back on the feet. Looked like he was in a submissive state on the ground, but he worked hard there to get back to the feet. Staying busy in the clinch, lands a nice punch there. Now some separation from his clinch position. Another takedown land. Yep, and he's got him secured in the half guard now. Get the ball here. All right, feet on the hips here. Look at him attack that arm triangle on the opposite side. When it's time to finish, he will lock his hands, pass his body all the way to the opposite side. Oh, he escapes! He got out. I mean, wow, that is great submission defense. Johnson, all the guys at AKA, I don't like what they're seeing out of Khabib Nurmagomedov striking here early in DC. We cross the midpoint in round one. To the body in it lands. Pretty good position here with the single collar in the clinch. Oh, how good was that combo? He is really doing a nice job stringing his shots together now. Immediately gets the underhook. Always busy here in the clinch, lands a nice punch there. Outstanding placement as he lands the knee to the body. Again, the taller fighter making noise with a knee strike there. Well, we talked about that one. Oh, he's stuck in the guillotine. Oh, that guillotine is officially tight. Great job landing from the top position. Oh, and there's another ground strike for good measure. All right, working on the ground here, his opponent's feet on the hips. Man, this is some serious ground and pound. He's trying to put this dude's head like through the canvas. He's one of the better ground and pound fighters we have in the entire UFC, and you're seeing why. All right, late round action here. Khabib Nurmagomedov continuing to dump. Oh, Kimura attack. Yup. Oh, that Kimura looks tight. No, oh, he's out. The fight's gonna continue. Oh, oh my goodness! I thought it was over. I thought this fight was over. UFC debut in 2012. He wasn't striking like that. No, he did not look like this. That's a credit to his coaches, not only at the American Kickboxing Academy, but at Eagles MMA over in Dallas. Back and forth we go.
Under a minute now to go in the round. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Severn. Keeping busy now, connecting with those punches. And he's throwing his punches with some conviction. You know, he's actually trying to make a statement when he throws it. Found a hole for that knee. Well, we'll see if he postures up and can get some of his ground strikes going here. Nurmagomedov's in half goal. Oh, triangle choke by Nurmagomedov. Oh, that arm triangle's wicked tight. He's starting to get it in very deep. Oh, this is tight. Oh, somehow he got out. That was beautiful. Look at how he brought his hips up in the air. Used his momentum to swing himself back to his chest being facing the mat. What a beautiful display of submission defense. All right, so that's the end of the round. A lot of highlights from which to choose, but his success in that round certainly rooted in his offensive takedown game. And that's what he does, right? He's a grinder. He's the type of guy that wants to get a hold of you, drag you to the floor. It doesn't bother him that much if you get back to your feet. He just wants to continue to make you work the entire time because he understands this type of grind most guys can't keep up with. You ready? You ready? Round two is on the way. Well, if you like wrestling and you like takedowns, I guess that's the round for you. He really had his way with his opponent there. Yeah, he was able to secure many takedowns, switching up the techniques, constantly changing the angle, never allowing his opponent to get a beat on what type of finish he was trying to go to. Well, I know Javier Mendez has said Khabib likes to go southpaw at times in training. Looks pretty good on the feet tonight. He looks really good in the stand-up. That is a part of his game that's underappreciated. He's a very good striker, and as he gets more comfortable in the octagon, he will continue to show. Well, not ideal to spend this much time on the bottom, but you can't fault him for his activity. Landing strikes here from the bottom. Nice work by Sever. All right, has the guard closed here. Khabib's in half guard now. Side control now. Oh, arm triangle attempt now. Oh, could be the beginning of the end. That looks tight. He's gonna go to sleep. It's over. And there it is! with style points tonight. Wow. Well, everybody in this arena is still digesting this result. What a win for him tonight, and he gets it done by submission, no less. He said he was going to get it done by submission. To watch an athlete call his shot is always fun. He should be very proud. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. I mean, you know this guy has such a great submission game that you cannot lay in his guard. He's so skilled, he's so tricky, and he's so good at weaving a web that gets you lost in it that he made him pay for it tonight and got the submission victory. We set it inside the octagon once more. Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is called to stop to this contest at one minute, 10 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by submission due to an arm triangle choke. And still, the undisputed USC heavyweight champion of the world. Habib the Eagle, Fernando Mera. All right, you heard it there from Bruce Buffer, Khabib Nurmagomedov, your winner by submission here tonight. This man is completely unstoppable, and he proved as much yet again tonight. Wow. He proved it again. You know, and as the career went longer, Khabib did a better job of finishing people. It was not only just take him down and he